And we are back live here in Scottsdale, Arizona, as we wait for the arrival of the TNW Intercontinental Champion and the man who will be in the eight-man battle royal coming up this Friday. Here he comes. Here comes Ash Ketchum. Oh, boy. Slapjack. And Ash Ketchum set the collide. Ash Ketchum wanting some sweet revenge for what happened to him last week. Lee Jones with a bowling contest is going to pour one ball. Making his way to the ring. Representing the Dream Team and the powerhouse from Palatown. She's ready to fight, but we don't know who she's taking on, but we're going to find out coming up later on in our Divas match. Ash Ketchum actually waiting for the arrival of Retribution. Oh boy, oh boy. And the lights have gone out. Here comes Retribution. The most disrespectful tag team to ever cut up a ring with a chainsaw and, and vandalize every property. There they are, Retribution, and there's Slapjack, another XPW champion, and his opponent from Parts Unknown, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the XPW European champion, Slapjack! Well, there are the champions of XPW on their way to the ring, and Mustafa Ali, I've been told is one half of the XPW Tag Team Champions with none other than Adia Devari, who sold out to XPW. I just can't believe these guys. That Retribution would just show up out of nowhere and attack Ash Ketchum for no apparent good reason. Like Slapjack made the first shot while Brian Cage was barking orders at the champions of XPW. And if I were Retribution, I'd be careful who you work with because Rob Black one time cut off the Messiah's thumb and hired a gang attack on him that following time back in Los Angeles. Not that bad though. Ash Ketchum focused and determined to get some, get some payback tonight at the last Tuesday night here. Here we go. Well, it had to feel good for Ash Ketchum at Pan last Sunday night in, in Kansas City attacking Retribution with that steel chair. And there was no controlling Ash Ketchum or Pan. He nailed half a retribution with that chair and did some damage. And a running big boot to Slapjack. And Ash Ketchum taking it straight to this man. Ash Ketchum from the top rope telling Slapjack to get up. What's Ash gonna do from the top? Don't look out! Nobody home. Slapjack just came to a census. Ash Ketchum counter that punch into a martial arts shot. And a springboard moonsault. Learning that one from his wife, Pan, who came so close to winning the TNW Divas European Championship earlier tonight. Not that bad. That was an amazing matchup. And you can tell Ash is not going to back down until he gets some sweet revenge here tonight. And there's another springboard moonsault by Ash taking down Slapjack. And right now, though, T-Bar, Mustafa Ali, along with reconnecting some wrestling girl we don't know about who's already the XPW Women's Hardcore Champion. Actually, the XPW Extreme Women's Champion that we just found out about. Not that bad, though. You can tell Slapjack now going for a camel clutch. She's the leg she's the legendary Iron Sheik. Ash Ketchum countering that punch, but Slapjack caught him. 
into a backbreaker and slapjack, doing whatever it takes to take out Ash Ketchum and disrespect everyone from TNW, just like how Tucker did last, last week when taking out our newest ACW superstar, Cameron Grimes. And Slapjack, in the meantime, though, is just decimating Ash and goes for another kick. Look out! One short shot from Ash, learning that one from his wife, Pan, to his father-in-law, Gohan. Cover! Two! And Ash Ketchum's done it! And that was sweet revenge right there for Ash and his wife. So now I'm out of here. Here is your winner, what a win for the Intercontinental Champion. If he wins this Friday night, he'll find himself in a World Championship opportunity heading his way into Las Vegas in your house six. Well, can he get it done this Friday? We'll find out for sure, because right now, though, folks, stick around. Coming up next, the in-ring debut of the Messiah, as we're being told, He's taking on none other than one of the than the XPW world champion himself, Brian Cage. Well, if I were Brian Cage, I think you're in for a rude awakening, my friend, because that matchup is coming to you, and it's live, and it's next. <laughs>